Hey friends, let's do Sleeping My Day Away Guitar Lesson by DAD. I'll talk you through all the guitar parts, all with on-screen tab and chord charts to make it easy to follow along, and we'll do the main solo at the end. Now for the tuning, we're tuned to D, so just put each string down a tone, and then sharpen them up to 350, so we're in between E flat and D. So let me play the intro rhythm, then we'll break it down. So we're just starting on this B power chord. We're going to do mute, mute, off. Now when I say off, I mean off the mute, not off the chord. So mute, mute, off, mute, mute, off, mute, off. And we do that four times. So do that through four times. Then on the fifth time, we do it one more time. So we're starting now where all the drums have kicked in. The sixth time through, do two mutes and off, and then do four mutes. One, two, three, four. We're gonna play a G chord, go down, down, down. Then when we go up, go to two on the E, three on the B, open G. So, so down, 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 up. And then just go to an E chord, down, 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 up. And do that part through three times, so. three times and the fourth time we do the start the same and then just finish on the E and that's a rhythm guitar now let's have a look at the solo So we're just playing the A string open hammer onto the second fret and then four on the D. And we do that three times. Then the fourth time play the open A hammer onto the second fret and then play open D and do that two times. And we repeat that part through two times here. So. And the third time through, start stays the same, open to two, four on the D. And then play open A, second fret, and go fourth fret on the G. So go back to the A, open two, four on the D. And then back to the A, open two, five on the D. Do a bend and release on four on the D. And then two. Then go back to the first one again, open two, four, open two, four, open two, four, and this last one, open two, open on the D string, then play the open again, two, slide to four, and then back to two. And that's the intro solo there. Now let's try the verse. Before we go on, if you're enjoying the lesson, please like and subscribe and say good day in the comments. We have new songs and lessons every week. You can make a small donation on my Patreon page and that really helps out. So let's get back into it. Starting on the B power chord, do two mutes off, two mutes off, mute. Then we're coming up to four on the A, seven on the D, play it open, two mutes, open, two mutes, open, mute. That's a pattern that's going to be for the rest of the chords. And we have D, open, mute, mute, open, mute, mute, open, mute. Go back to A, open, mute, mute, open, mute, mute, open, mute. 
back to D the same again. Up to E power chord this time, so open mute, mute, open mute, mute, open mute. Then go back to the B, we're going to play open mute, mute, open mute, mute, open mute, open, then mute, mute, open mute, mute, open mute, open. So a little bit weird, just take your time with that. If you listen to the song, it's not that hard to pick up. Then go back to the start again. Eighth notes on that E for two bars. So one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And, and that's our verse there. Then we have our chorus. Let me do that for you. same as the intro on the B, we're just not doing a hard palm mute, we're not, we're just keeping it nice and loose but the rhythm stays the same, mute, mute, off, mute, mute, off, mute, off, mute, mute, off, mute, 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 so. then the G stays the same, down, 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 to our D, to the E, so exactly the same as the intro. Do that three times, and the fourth time the staff stays the same. The G, the D, and then just do the E for two bars, build up on eighth notes here. One, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four. Then go back to the B. It's actually a B minor chord there, so if you want to play the whole chord, that's okay. So. Time play the G and then just play the E and the B string up, up, and then go back to two on the E, three on the B. So, and then just finish on E and hold for a bar there. And that's our chorus and our little post chorus part from the B to the G with our up strokes. To the E there. Then we have the solos for the chorus. Then we have our chorus fills there in exactly the same as the intro. Open A to 2nd fret, 4th fret on the D. Hold that and then we do the open to 2nd fret A and then open D. Just do that four times. Then for our little post chorus part it's the same as the intro. So. so same there. Then we have the next verse, and that's exactly the same. We have one little fill in that, so let me do that for you. So we're just playing the B minor, do two hammer on to three on the B, palm mute the fourth fret on the G two times, and then do two hammer on to four on the G, and then we're just building up on that B power chord again. And that's the little fill there in the verse. Then we go back to the chorus again, we do it exactly the same as before. We do the last E this time for three bars instead of two bars. So we're just doing that build up one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. And then we do our little post chorus part, but this time do it two times instead of one. That's with our G. To our E there. Then we have the bridge. Let me do that for you. two on the A string and that's also the solo note so you can play that there instead if you want with the solo then we just play the B minor again four on the G three on the B then we're just going to a B power chord and we're just going to play eighth notes or part muting two bars one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and then come up to the G power chord, we're going to play five on the D7 on the G for one bar, one and two and three and four and 
go back to E, so two and four, do half a bar, one and two and, and then play four on the G, two on the B, and then three on the B, four on the G, and then back to four and two, so and, and. And then we go back to the B again, so one and two and three and four and to the G, one and two and three and four and. Now this time we just do the build up on the E to finish the bridge off there for two bars. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Then we have our little break there as well, so let me do that for you. power chord two times and then back to the B. Do that again. D, D, B. Do our G with our little feel that we did before. And then E. Do that again. D, D, B. Do the G again. Now feel. Then just do a build up with eighth notes again, palm muting on the E. Do this for four bars. One, two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and D. And that's for the end of our bridge and the solo still playing in that part there. And from there we just play the chorus four times. <laughs> Chorus through four times, and the fifth time through, we do the B the same, the G the same, the D to the E. Then just go back to the G with our fill to E. Do that again to the E. Then just do the G with the fill two times. G. Then just play G four times. Two, three, four, and we're going to end on our B bar chord, but adding the F sharp at the top there, so we're doing a B over F sharp. And there are all the rhythm parts. Now let's have a look at the solo. second fret on the A, and come up to seven on the A, slide up to nine, play nine, nine slide back to seven, seven, seven slide back to five, five, five slide back to four, slide back up to five, play seven, slide up to nine, and nine again. slide up to 9 on the A, play 9 on the D, 10 on the D, do a bend and release on the 10, 9, and then A, 12, 10. And then still on the A, just play 7, hammer on the 10, pull off the 7. Then we've got this little sweep here, we're going to play 7E, seven, 7 on the A, and then 4 on the D. Hammer on to 7D, pull off to 4. And then play 4 on the D again. Do a bend on 4 on the A. Play 4, 2. Then play 4 on the D again. Bend 4 on the A, bend and release. 
four on the D, slide up to five. And then play two on the A, bend and release four on the D, four on the G, back to four on the D, bend and release. Then we're jumping to the G string, nine, pull off to six, slide up to seven. Back to D, four, slide up to five. G, six, seven. D, four, slide up to five. Seven, G to B, five, seven, five. So. Then we have this little pedal tone. We're gonna to slide up to four on the G. Five, B, four, G, seven, B, four, G, eight, B, four, G, then jump to E, 5, and do a bend on 5. So slowly. Then the next part, we're using a heavy guitar, I'll just start on the clean guitar here. We're playing 4 on the G, to the B, 3, 2 times. Back to 4, G, 3 on the B. Then just play open B and E. Then we do B again, third fret two times. Four on the G, four on the G again. Back to the three on the B two times. Four on the G. Then to finish off, three on the B and the open B and E again there. And that's our main solo. Now let's have a look at the outro solo. So we're just starting with a bend on 7 on the E, so we just play 7 and do 2 bends. Then just play 7. Then we're doing our open A to 2nd fret. And then open D, and then just play 2nd fret D. Then open A 2nd fret, and 4 on the D. Then back to that first one again, open A 2nd fret, open D, 2nd fret D. Then we have the next part of the solo using a heavy guitar. So we're just starting with a bend on 17B. Play 15E, bend again on 17B, bend and release, 15B, 16 on the G. Then we're doing 11 slide to 12 on the D. G, 9 two times, back to D, 12, 11, 12, and then 9 on the G. Then jump to A, go 7 slide to 9. Back to D, 11, slide to 12, this time G, 9, 10, 10, 9, D, 12, 9, and then 9 on the G. Then again, A, 7, slide to 9, D, 11, slide to 12, G, 9, 9, 12, 11, 12, and then to finish off we're just D string 9, 12, 9, 12, 9, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, and then 9 there. And that's the outro solo there and near all the parts. So thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed slipping by Day Away Guitar Lesson by DAD. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell and I'll see you soon.